Over the next few videos, I'm going to be taking a look at intermolecular forces. Intermolecular forces. Molecule. Now, um, before I make those videos about intermolecular forces, I just want to, in this video, quickly have go take a brief overview of what um, intermolecular forces are. Now. Intermolecular forces are weaker than the free um, stronger forces. The free stronger forces, which I haven't talked about the third one, but the two ones I have talked about so far in my videos, as of as of making, as of the day of me making this video, is um, covalent bonding and ionic bonding. I haven't made, um, at the time of making this video, I haven't made um, the video about metallic bonding yet, but I will be making uh, that very, very, very soon. But, um, and the third force is metallic bonding. This is to do with um, metal ions and uh, electrons. But yeah, these three forces are all stronger than all of the intermolecular forces which I'm going to be talking about. And there are three different types of intermolecular forces, which I'm going to be talking about before I actually tell you what these forces are. Basically, what intermolecular forces are, are forces between molecules. So these, these um, forces here, covalent bonding, ionic bonding, metallic bonding, these forces tended to be strong. Um, these, force tended, these forces tended to be forces which were between molecules so inside a particular molecule there were forces between the atoms in those molecules like covalent bonding um ionic bonding and this ionic bonding obviously it was forces between ions but similar sort of concept and metallic bonding it's forces between uh ions and electrons i haven't made a video yet but i will be making that and um yeah whereas in intermolecular uh forces it's forces between molecules. So you might have a, a molecule here and it has some sort of maybe attraction. So it has an attraction to a, a molecule here. And so these aren't atoms. So these molecules would contain atoms maybe. And this would contain atoms. But uh, these wouldn't... Um, this isn't forces between the atoms in the molecule. Well, it's an overall. It's, 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 it's an overall force. What I would say is an it's an overall force between the actual molecules rather than simply the atoms in in, in individual molecules. And the three types of um, I think it will make more sense when I actually make the specific videos. But the three forces, the three types of intermolecular forces which I'm going to be talking about are first of all induced dipole dipole forces. Induced. Dipole, dipole forces. Um, and these these forces are also have another name. Uh, they're named after the guy that uh, I think the guy that discovered um, the presence of these forces. The they're called Van Van der Waals forces. Van the Waals Waals forces. And the last one, uh, no, not the last one. The second one is called permanent dipole dipole forces. Permanent dipole dipole forces. And at the end of my last video, I talked a little bit about forces of attraction between two HCl. Well, that's my last video. I talked about the attractive forces between maybe like I, I did an example of two HCl, uh, two hydrogen chlorine, um, yeah, hydrogen, hydrogen chloride, was it hydrogen? Yeah, hydrogen chloride. I did a um, small uh, diagram of attractive forces between two hydrogen chloride molecules. And as I said in that video, the uh, for the dipoles, the, those two molecules had dipoles. And those would be an uh, that would be an example of the permanent dipole dipole forces. But I will be making a, a more detailed video about that. And the third force, the third intermolecular force, is um, hydrogen bonding.
and this is a very important force in like um, plants and and things like that and it gives a lot of different properties to water and I'll be looking um, into that in the video about hydrogen bonding so yeah I just wanted to tell you guys what vid what um, what different kinds of intermolecular bonding exist and yeah I'll be making those videos so see you guys in those next few videos